Yeah. Yo team, if you are looking for cheap reliable flies in a wide range, make sure you check out nzfishingflies.com Yo, what up Whakafanu? Welcome to another episode. Uh, today, as you can see, our rivers are absolutely blowing out and uh, me and Gabe have been driving for three hours, I think the time is, yeah the time's nine o'clock and uh, yeah we started our adventure at six, we've been driving three hours and uh, all we've found is just chocolate, chocolate, chocolate everywhere. And uh, which isn't great, it's kind of like streamer material. But um, we have found one trib that is f fishable. And uh, yeah, we're down here just bloody gonna have a go. Um, I got my glass out and uh, yeah, let's just get into it. We'll just, we'll just see if we can get some tight lines. I mean, I'm not expecting much. Might have to get the streamer line and have a go in here, but on the edges, but. Who knows? We'll see how it goes, but uh, yeah, just bloody get into it, have a good time, hopefully get some tight lines and uh, get a video out for you. So, yeah, let's pump it. Good fish, bro, bro. Look at all the other good fish. Oh, nice, Gabe. Uh, won't be a sec. Mm. Woo, baby. Bro, there was so many fish just there. Bro, that was a nice fish. It was a nice fish. Thanks oh, so damn. That was like instant. So it's been uh, four hours since I last vlogged and uh, we've changed rivers, we found a nice kind of clearer one and uh, Gabe just dropped a pretty nice fish, would have been the fish of the day. I've caught three small as tiny, tiny fish and um, Gabe's got one alright fish but I didn't film it just because he was so far away. But that's alright, might start getting into fish, some fish now with this, this river. It's, it's a pretty nice river. Um, it's the only clear one on the on the system, so kind of forced to fish here. But I'm on the check nymph again. The glass, I kind of put that away because the rivers are so high, and I was like, oh, I'll put it away. I'll just get the check nymph out. And um, yes, yeah, so I've got three on that, but they're all tiny. But that's all right. Yeah, so I'm just going to fish this bit in here. Probably pull out a couple. We'll see how it goes, eh? All right, check nymph on. Seventy-five years later. It was a fish. I think it's a brown, eh? Well, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I don't think it's very well hooked either. Uh, oh, he's hooked. Stop following me. I'm trying to get beneath him. <laughs> mate, mate, I got a big brown, eh? You gotta take a shot at him wherever he came out. I've got a big brown, mate. You need to get him into the Where the hell was he sitting? Uh, he was sitting in that market. Oh, yeah, is it a boat? No. No, it is a brown, eh? Yeah. Oh, get him in the net, mate. Yeah, -hoo -hoo. bro, that's a that's not a bad fish. That's a good fish. Fish of the day so far. Yeah, got me brown, bloody steak. All right, 
Oh, you know what he took? A giant size 10 nymph. A giant size 10 nymph, mate. He's, a, he's beat up, man. He's beat up. He's had a hard laugh. Ah. Oh, yes. Oi. Yeah, there's another one. Uh, they'll peered up. And I, I hit the back one. I didn't know that it was actual fish, but now I do. Oh, hey, hey, where are you going? Yeah. Hey, back over and down. Just stay where you are. Oh, yeah. Just like with the brown. But he is wanting to run across and down. <laughs> Yeah, but it's Barbara's hook, mate. Oh! Oh! They just pull out. Yeah. Why won't he come back? Oh. Ooh. Wow then. Wow. wow. Team Plan Z kind of paid off. Uh, we found this nice, beautiful river that we've never fished before, that we've driven over a million times. But um, we now know what we're in for, and uh, I think we'll probably be back up here again, maybe in in summertime or something like that. Maybe before summer, we'll come back up here and see if we can get these browns. Unfortunately, we had two opportunities. We, me, and Gabe. Had two opportunities. <laughs> and uh, some some bloody brig browns, mate. And uh, yeah, no, she didn't she didn't pay off, but that's all right. We had a bloody good day. I think we ended up with 10, 10 fish plus, kind of between each other. Whether they, that be a little tiny fingerling or uh, all right size. Small. Yeah, some of them weren't that small, but um. Yeah, nah, she was a bit of all over the shop. I'm sorry for the footage, like, I know that the footage is going to be short and sweet. Uh, I wasn't really on the ball. So, yeah. But anyway, thank you all for watching. If you're going to go shop at maxcatch.co.nz, make sure you use the code fucker 5 because then they know that you're part of the fucker whanau and that would be awesome. Go to NZ Fishing Flies. All my fish today were caught on a jig hook here in Copper. Sorry if it's getting loud, but uh, just trying to traverse down these, these rapids. But yeah, uh, all of them were caught on a jig hook here in Copper on the old check nymph. So yeah, and Gabe was using a, what does he mean? Oh, some, a couple of flies. He's, he's tied himself, some caddis flies. 
So that's what Gabe put his ones on. But yeah, thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff. We'll see you next week for a, hopefully another episode of Fuck Trout. And uh, oh yeah, just a heads up, it's almost Christmas, so that means Fishmas. We're gonna be doing Fishmas again. We're gonna make it bigger and better than last year. Last year's one was a bit of a flop, but we did gain quite a few Fakafano members from that, so we're gonna have another crack at it. And hopefully it's bigger, better than last year. So something to look forward to. See you guys later. Uh, gotta let them know I'm uncontrollable. Hey. Oh, really, when they roll with me. I'm uncontrollable.